Hey everyone, Happy New Year! Yay. It's January 1st. We have made it to 2021. On Wednesday, as we were wrapping up the year, we talked about some silly rituals for saying goodbye to the year. So now we wanted to talk about some little rituals for welcoming the year ahead. I'm actually gonna mention this on Sunday when I welcome you to the worship service. But something Jen and I have been doing for quite a while is that when we enter New Year, we come up with a word or maybe a little phrase about what this is going to be the year of. And I know that seems a little inconsequential. I mean, what does a word actually do? But no kidding, last year my word was uh, the year of stillness. I needed to just kind of be still and figure out what was important in life. I decided that. Had no idea how much time I was going to have for stillness in the year ahead. Um, but your work can be anything. Maybe this is the year of hope, the year of resiliency, the year of marching forward, the year of turning a new leaf. Whatever you want the year to be, you can come up with a word. And that's just a good way to set an intention, do some introspection, and decide what work you need to do inside to prepare for the year ahead. Right, so this is actually a tradition that a lot of churches participate in every year. They take this idea of taking a word and making it the focus of your year, and they use it on Epiphany Sunday, which is this Sunday, and they put them on little star-shaped cards, and they pass them out to the congregation on Epiphany Sunday um, in honor of the Magi who followed the star for um, a while to find baby Jesus. And so the idea is that your star word for the year will help you seek uh, your, your own spiritual journey you, will help you find Christ, will help you further down your path um, wherever you might be. And so, yeah, this is something that churches do, and we're excited to um, invite you to do this with us this year. So, yeah, start thinking of what word you might want to help guide you this year into something new. And so then on Sunday, if you're watching with us at 10 a.m., share it in the chat. Be thinking what your word is, and in a year from now, we can check in and See, See how, how the year did. went. Yeah. <laughs> Let's say a prayer together. Gracious God, we thank you for all of the ways in which you lead us forward, the ways in which you place shining stars of hope in our life, and the ways in which you invite us into deeper spirituality and deeper connection with ourselves and with you. We pray all of these things in Christ's name. Amen. Amen. We'll see you soon.